working for you. You're watching Fox 4 News at 9. You never think it's going to happen to you, and then it does. Tonight, the parents of baby Lisa speak out at a vigil. They're remembering the night she was last seen two years ago. A vigil for baby Lisa is first on Fox. I'm Mary Pulley. And I'm Rob Collins. A police investigation continues two years later, and the family continues hoping for her safe return. Fox 4's Matt Evans is working a few live outside the house where the vigil was held in the place Lisa's parents last saw her. That's right. It's been a very emotional week for the parents of baby Lisa Irwin. It was this week, two years ago, when baby Lisa disappeared. The tonight, friends and relatives of the family prayed for her safe return and say they aren't giving up hope. Earlier this week, the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children released this picture of what baby Lisa might look like now. Lisa's mother says that picture generated a mix of emotions. She said it was good to see what her girl might look like, but also is sad that it's only a picture. Tonight, the family told me that the support of the community is one thing that has helped them through this difficult time. We have had um, an amazing support system. Um, the community is amazing. Even when I'm out getting groceries for the house, somebody always stops just to tell me that they're praying and that they're thinking about her and it means so much to us that she's still on your minds. Dozens of people came to the house today to show their support for the family including the people that are still trying to find baby Lisa. Right now the family is mostly inside the house. There's still a few people out in the yard playing uh, but they did tell us earlier today that they hope the age progression photo will help turn up some leads and help find baby Lisa. Matt Evans Fox 4 News working for you live in Kansas City.